Hello there YouTube. We're beginning to paint the Schwinn stretch chopper frame here. A little test of the color. This camera doesn't show it up. It's a lot nicer than that. There's the cap. The camera's showing it lighter than what it is. Trust me, it's darker than that. This is your base coat. I went over brown primer so I know when it missed. This is your base coat. And I'll spray a little bit in the air and see if you can see it. Highly metallic. Oh, it's floating back on my camera. Very highly metallic. It's just loaded with glitter. If I was out in the sun, it would blind me. i got to get in the shade. Pretty humid out. I shouldn't be painting today. That's why today is just going to be the base coat. Let it cure till tomorrow. Let it cure 24 hours. I can see it on my camera where it's floating around landing. But I took some still shots, and it is darker than that. I went off in the shade. So if you see it in the store, it's just green. I don't know what they call it. It says green and an eyes. MC203 is the number. Had to go to a hot rod type store. Uh, some places don't carry the colors you want. They had blue, purple, red. They didn't have, uh, they didn't have gold, they didn't have that copper. The company's coming out with a copper coat with a clear coat that goes over it. Real quick view here. It might be a little darker than that. This camera just does not want to pick up that color as nice as it is. I've even switched out my camera films trying to get rid of that purple stuff in the sun. So this is kind of a test too. You got like an NTSC whatever, then you got a PAL video mode. I'm on the PAL video mode. If anybody knows about cameras, I can't figure it out what it is. I just run the thing. Getting those purple streaks. We'll go off towards the sun once and see if I get them. There's a little bit showing up. So I'm getting right at the sun. My eyes, my eyes. It ain't fun, I don't want to do it. But I'm not getting it down in here. I was getting that purple when I tried to film stuff. But so much for that, I want to make this so long just for this. Just the base coat. Very highly reflective silver metallic. It's called ground coat. You have to use this. You will not get that andonized look. You won't get that sparkle through your paint. Maybe if I switch to telemacro, but you won't get that sparkle in your paint. You'll get the green color over silver if you use like a cheap aluminum spray paint. You won't get that metal flake sparkle. That's the whole trick. You get that sparkle. Some factory frames back then didn't have that sparkle. They just had that andonized look. Like Schwinn had green and blue, different colors. You didn't have a whole lot of sparkle in some of the older ones. I'm trying to imitate something that Schwinn would have done. Make this too long. In case anybody's interested, it is a lot prettier than on camera. This looks whited out, faded out to me on camera. This is a nice color. You just can't, you just don't want to give me the right color that it is. It's a lot prettier now. Well, so much for that. Thanks for watching. Tomorrow I should have the frame painted so humid I am not painting and with the wind, you notice how the wind's blowing out here. I'm not wasting my green. I wasted enough with a metallic base coat with it blowing away in the wind. Thanks for watching.